when I started to venture down that valley of the zone of the unknown, because we fear the, the things that we don't understand. Right. You know? So breaking through that barrier in my mind, it took time because yeah. we have all these stigmas surrounding what we think urine is, what we feel like our waters, that we feel like it's a waste. We feel like, oh, it's filthy. Don't get it on your hands, nasty. And right. so even with TV, with movies, with all the jokes and all the, you know, the comedians and stuff, all those layers and layers and layers, what I started to do was I filled up a bottle and then I would go into, you know, a, a restroom on the side street. And so I told myself repetitively over and over in my subconscious, mineral water, mineral water, mineral water, because they said that it had all these vitamins, minerals, and nutrients, and things that, yeah. you know, we naturally, it's like the most ultra filtered. So the medical term is plasma ultra filtrate. So mm -hmm. we usually think that our water or what comes out the front, the channel of conception, you know, why would the semen, why would the life force, the vital fluid, why would that come out the same channel as something filthy, as mm -hmm. a waste product? Why would life that gives, you know, life, that mm -hmm. makes life, why would that mm -hmm. come out the same channel as something filthy, as a waste product? So I started to ask myself those questions uh. and then went down the rabbit hole. You know, I was like Neo in the Matrix. I was looking for the answers. You know? <laughs> Trinity, Trinity, help, you know? So it was teaching me that not everything is as it seems. Yeah. And when I kept saying, you know, okay, it's not a waste product. It's not a product of waste filtration. It's a product of blood filtration. It's like mm. the, the blood plasma. It's plasma ultra filtrate. That's the medical term. So they know this, but they're not teaching this. This is not the knowledge that we learned in college. So right. I was like, okay, what do I do with this information? So I decided to, as I was doing the research, like we fire signs, we Leos, you know, while most people are thinking about it or talking about it, we just do it. We just do it, right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So I went and I just did it. And as soon as I did it, Darian, my body started purging. I'm talking about flushing all the, everything that was not me started to come out of my body. So I just was taking trips to the bathroom, trips to the bathroom, trips to the bathroom, like going in and out the restroom. And my body just started to get it rid of all the sediment, all the, the you know, everything just started to come out. And then it got clearer and clearer and clearer. Uh -huh. And it got more purified, more crystalline. It got the aroma changed. There was no odor. Yeah. The taste uh -huh. changed. It was like coconut water after a while because I was just drinking juice and coconut water. Uh -huh. And then even the color changed. It became clear to the point where eventually, months later, I could sit at a table with friends and family and I could have it in a wine glass and they wouldn't know the difference. They thought it was no water or way. like or something. <laughs> they wouldn't know the difference. They never asked me like, what are you drinking? It's just water, right? <laughs> oh so, my God. So it blew, it blew my mind. So yeah, that's why I tell people, you know, find out for yourself. Don't just take my word for it. Mm -hmm. You know, do your own research. I did a lot of research. And I found out through, you know, my own self-experience, what can happen, the level of energy that can come back into the body that you can actually release when you, when you release. Yeah. yeah. Wow. So thank wow. you for That's the question. Powerful. I appreciate it. I appreciate thank it. you so much for sharing. That yeah. is. That's a that's some golden knowledge right there. Whoa, 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 whoa,